October the 28th, 2006, I'm taking you to the government of Guyana's website, the National HIV and AIDS Program. Take a look at that, Government of Guyana. It's the real deal. Look in my URL browser, okay, .gov. This is the real deal. What they were doing is the health ministry slammed Reverend Ernest Ainsley for HIV claims. Uh, according to the health ministry, they said that the visiting evangelist, Ernest Angeli, is misrepresenting the facts about HIV by promising to cure the virus and other STDs at his crusades. That's straight from the government. I'm going to take you to a video clip. Ernest Angeli cooperated with the government to the fullest extent, had individuals tested before and after the crusade, those who were healed. Here's the report. Now one of the greatest happenings probably in your life. You're about to see four children that the Lord revealed to me in the Sutu. They all four had AIDS and the Lord told me they were being healed. The lady that has this orphanage, Sister Mavis, is coming to the platform to tell you the story. The four cases have been documented. Before and after. Now I'm fast forwarding because I'd like you to kind of cut to the chase and see what happens. And I took them to the hospital again for about to be tested. You find it that it's the same way. Because I got her, it was during the rainy day. They just put them. Now, folks, I'm going to uh, cut away for just a minute. The bottom line is they were medically tested after the crusade. Uh, each one of these four individuals, the reports came back uh, HI, uh, AIDS negative, negative. Uh, the before and afters are right there, period. I will be posting additional uh, medical verification of uh, healings that Jesus Christ performed. Again, it's very important to understand Reverend Ernest Ainsley never, ever claims to be a healer. He is not a faith healer. He is a man who believes that Jesus Christ, in the person of the Holy Spirit, still indeed performs miracles today, just like he did 2,000 years ago. And that ordinary believers, just like you and I, we can have our life changed, impacted, healed through a prayers of faith, if we live clean, trust God, love our fellow man, and line up with Scripture, indeed, God is faithful to confirm His Word.